So I'm assuming that you've read the passage. Based on the information in the passage, which of the following can be inferred about a company whose product is identical to, but significantly less expensive than, a competing product? Okay, so let's see which one of these makes sense. A, the company should not differentiate its product from the competing product. Well, differentiation is what you do when your product is um, different and more expensive. So if yours is less expensive, you don't want to differentiate because the passage says um, consumers will, when faced with two equivalent choices, generally make a decision about which one to purchase based on price. So if yours is already cheaper, yours already stands out. And if yours is identical to somebody else's but cheaper, consumers are more likely to buy yours. So you actually don't want to differentiate. Let's check the other answer choices. The company should search for unique selling points for their product and market based on those. That is the definition of product differentiation, and you don't need to do it if yours is already the cheaper one and you're identical. Um, C, the company should raise its prices so that it will maximize its profit. Well, you know, maybe it should do that, but that's um, then you no longer have the um, competitive advantage based on price, so maybe not. The company should place more emphasis on the non-price features of its product. Well, again, if price is the only difference between your product and the other one, that's its selling point, and you don't want to distract from that. And uh, E, the company should target a niche market for its product. I don't even know what that's doing there. So clearly, choice A, you should not differentiate your product if it's already differentiated on price and is otherwise identical, because people are going to choose the one that's cheaper.